Hello everyone, Vegas Thoughts Live here. Uh, we're going to do a segment on server-based gaming. Um, I figured I'd start doing these uh, informative segments um, in conjunction with posting slot videos because let's face it, like every slot channel uh, posts slot videos and live play and all other you know various things. So um, I want it to be a little bit different and share some information that you guys might find useful uh, in regards to uh, slot machines and gaming in general. So, let's get started. So, server-based gaming. In case anyone um, hasn't heard of this term before, so server-based gaming is basically a centralized uh, system in a casino that allows the um, slot manager to set paybacks, um, denominations and games for their cabinets uh, across the entire casino. So for example, uh, with server-based gaming, they can set a schedule for their entire property. So for all their machines, uh, a payback schedule. So this allows the casino to adjust paybacks based on time of day, uh, weekends, events, things of that nature. Now this isn't something that's changed uh, a ton of times it's basically a static setting based on you know general analytics that the casino um, <clears throat> has access to and they set the paybacks accordingly so for an example um, on a weekend all the machines might be set to pay back 89 percent uh, so saturday friday saturday sunday the machines would be set to pay back anywhere between you know 90 92 percent 89 just a range between 89 and you know 92 percent um during the week the same machines would be set to pay back 94 percent maybe 95 percent um the reason that there's a disparity between the paybacks during the weekend and during the week is because during the weekend uh, casino has a captive audience, there's more customers, there's more traffic, so there really is no incentive to um, increase the paybacks of these machines because you already have a ton of people there and they're going to play regardless whether the machine's set at 95% or whether it's set at 85%. So uh, during the week you would have machines that would be set back to pay a little bit more because you have less traffic and those are really those customers that come during the week are really the bread and butter of the casinos. So um, alienating those customers definitely wouldn't be a good idea because you can't stay in business um, just making money two days a week. You have to make money every day. So um, I know there's a lot of sites out there that uh, say that server-based gaming uh, isn't very widespread and that casinos don't do this. Um, and that uh, casinos have to change a chip if they want to uh, change a payout percentage on a machine. And this just simply isn't true. So um, any modern casino that you visited that's been built um, in the last 10 years uh, has this technology. For casinos that are older, I would say at least 75% of them have converted to this technology in one way or another. It may not be all machines, but... Um, it's a large majority. So if you find yourself noticing that when you go to the casino on the weekend, um, you don't win as much as when you go during the week, that's why. It has nothing to do with luck. It has nothing to do with, um, you know, the machine you're sitting at. It has everything to do with the payback percentage. Um, basically, you know, luck definitely does play a factor in uh, whether you're going to win or lose. But at the end of the day, the payback percentage that the machines are set to ultimately dictate uh, your fate. So um, you'd have to be very, very lucky to win on a machine that's set to 85%. Um, whereas if you're playing a machine that was set to 92% you wouldn't need to be as lucky. Uh, reason being obviously is with a 92% machine you're going to get a lot of little returns as you go and those returns help you uh, keep your bankroll up and uh, 
eventually the hope is to hit a jackpot or, or a big win. With a lower paying machine, you're going to have to cycle through a lot more money and you'll end up losing a lot more. And chances are you'll go broke before you can win anything. Um, so in a nutshell, that's uh, server based gaming. Now, uh, in Nevada, for example, um, payback percentages can only be made when the machine is idle for five minutes or longer. So they can't change payback percentages on a machine while you're playing it. Um, the machine has to be idle. These changes, the scheduling changes are generally made, uh, you know, in the middle of the night, four or five in the morning when no one is playing the machines. Uh, so that's that. And that basically is the server based gaming. Uh, so, uh, you know, a lot of the people that play slot machines are very uh, superstitious. So they think, you know, oh, it's weird. You know, I go to the casino one day and I win. And I go every Saturday and I lose. Not every time, but most of the time. So that's the answer to that. Um, and in case anyone would like to research server-based gaming um, and kind of just uh, verify what I've said is true, um, I'll provide some links in the description. Uh, basically, it's called the Bally Control Center, um, and it allows casinos to schedule paybacks and all that good stuff. Um, so anyway... That's this segment, and I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and have a great day. Thanks.